Gems are the rarest of resources in Clash of Clans. Required for unlocking your first five builders, making purchases in the trader, or buying cosmetic skins for heroes, in today's video I'm going to explain six facts about the do's and don'ts for obtaining gems for free. What's going on my friends? My name is Joe and welcome back to the show. Today we're gonna talk about a real hot topic, free gems. We all like those free gems and we're gonna give you some facts on how to get free gems for both inside the game and a fact for those that are on the outside of the game. These are the ones that we definitely want to avoid. So the very first one we're gonna look at is these Clash of Clans free gem hack websites. This is a major do not do this, do not use these because there are some stipulations. FBI, open up! Daddy. Or you have the possibility of having your Clash of Clans account hacked or Clash of Clans just bans your account permanently. It's just open promises. Try to avoid them. I promise you, they just do not work. Free gem fact number two, the removal of obstacles from both the home village and the builder village. Obstacles such as the tree, the bush, the trunk and the mushroom, they spawn daily. About every eight hours, you should have a brand new obstacle on your village. And when you claim these bad boys, you should get about 50 free gems every single week. Let's test that theory real fast. On this account, we have zero gems. We have both obstacles on the home village and the night village. So we're gonna pull these off real fast. Let me activate a builder pot and let's get started. Eighty two gems. Fact number three the gem box on the home village worth twenty five free gems. Now, here's the thing when it comes to the gem box, you can only have one of these at a time. And there are some videos out there that claim that if you pull it and cancel it before the builder reaches back halfway, this stuff does not really work. You have to pull the gem box and you need to activate the timer within the game and they should respawn about every seven days. So over the course of one month, you should be able to claim 100 free gems from the gem box. Free gem fact number four, the completion of achievements, whether it's just upgrading buildings, destroying town halls, trophy pushing, or reaching milestones such as clan war stars. Each of these will provide you free gems. As of 2022, there are a total of 15,937 gems available by completion of achievements. So according to what we have right now, after pulling all those obstacles, we're up to 107 gems from zero. Let's go ahead and get into our achievements and claim some of these. That way we can see how many we can pull just by what's saved here. Oh, 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 yeah, that was a monster right there, my friends. We're up to 2,672 gems for free. For our newer players that are trying to unlock the fourth and the fifth builder, if you are a Town Hall 7 or 8, there are two achievements that you should focus in on completing by trophy pushing. Sweet Victory and League All-Star. By completing these, you should get around 3,715 gems by reaching Champions League. <laughs> Free gem fact number five, the gem mine. Even if you do not like playing the builder base, by rushing your builder's hall to level nine allows you to increase the level of your gem mine to level nine as well. This increases your production rate to 4.8 gems per day. And on an average, you should be able to pull about 22 gems every five days. So let's claim this gem mine right here, and that will be 14 free gems, the level of this mine mine is only level five. So obviously a level nine would help out quite a bit. 
which leads us into free gem fact number six the selling of magic items so let's say that you've completed a bunch of those achievements and exhausted all those free gems a lot of players tend to turn to this option next when selling these potions up top they should sell for about 10 gems a piece a very popular one would be the power potion or even the clock tower potion to get some free gems but the most popular item that a lot of free-to-play players out there tend to sell is the shovel of obstacles this bad boy will provide you 50 free gems but remember you might need it to move an obstacle of importance like a christmas tree or a birthday cake depending on how you play the game some other methods to get free gems in clash of clans would also be the new player pass which is available for town hall 2 through town hall 6 the completion of challenges in the events tab and also claiming gems as rewards in the clan games each of these options will vary on the amount of gems that you will claim now we started with zero gems available on this account and we will finish with 2786 gems by practicing the methods that we saw in today's video minus the first one of course and then naturally if you do not feel like waiting on doing any of the tasks that were discussed in today's video you can always go into the shop go to the treasure tab and buy gems with real money if you enjoyed today's content make sure to leave a like on the video consider subscribing and we will see you in the next video